So we're here at Silverstone for the Formula Student 2023 event where NCME Racing from the University of Bolton and we're competing in Formula Student 2023 and hoping to do really well. It's competition by the Institute of Mechanical Engineers. It's one of the pinnacle events for engineers. We go to compete in a range of events split into two halves really, so you've got the static side and the dynamic side. The biggest hurdle for the dynamic events is the scrutineering that's involved. Scrutineers make sure that you're compliant with the regulations and most importantly, you're safe to go out on track. I feel confident with the car. We had to do a few changes because uh, they found a few non-compliances. So we fixed them and we're up to the standards now and hopefully we'll pass it now. Once we've gotten through scrutineering, will be high up there because a lot of teams just don't manage to get that far. Wide track of the car is a little bit too wide, so we just need to bring uh, our second set of tyres to make it a little bit thinner and uh, so we can just uh, go for the tilt test. The biggest setback of all in the past few weeks has been the last couple of days with our scrutineering. They've been really harsh on us, it's been our first year, we've got some stuff we've had to fix, we've really had to try hard. We did it! We did it! Well done boys, that's a weight off our shoulders. <laughs> yeah. uh, we've finally passed scrutineering, so we can move on to hopefully technical this afternoon. So the noise test, again, you've got to get your, you know, just to seeing how loud the exhaust is. So our, at first our exhaust was too loud. So we had to stuff some more padding inside the exhaust to dampen down the sound. We got that done, we passed it, and then we got out to the brake test, and unfortunately, we didn't pass the test. Once we've got the brake testing done and skid plan, we can then, tomorrow, we'll be out on track, definitely. So the sticker on the car starts out blank and every test that you go through you get a sticker. When you've got six stickers that is effectively your badge of achievement. To get that as a first year team is absolutely phenomenal. It's one of those things you need to put your first foot forward and you just keep going. Chain came off and instantly we just went to the rev limit and North Throttle tried the gears, no gears because chain isn't connected. Was there any indication that that was going to happen? Uh, no, it just happened instantly. Uh, literally, I was putting power on down the corner, boom, boom, and then, yeah, done. So, yeah, nothing, nothing we could do about it. We're waiting to find out if there's a possibility of us having a second go. We're currently classified as DNF, so we're waiting to find out. DNF stands for did not finish. It means that you don't get any points. The fact that the team have got to endurance, I'm really proud of everyone. And the car only did two laps, but as far as we know, only first year competing team that have actually completed scrutineering and competed. So I'm massively proud of the whole team. It's been really great. Next year, they're coming back to the competition with experience. It's going to be a team that's already done it. They're going to have new members. They're going to be able to learn from each other. They're just going to build on that and they're going to come back so much stronger next year.